Tell me a little bit about your history with, with, with Black Messiah. Oh, he was serious. He was very serious. He's coming down on my block. I'm, I'm from 115th Street, Lennox and Saint, between Lennox and Saint Nick. And like a PAL block. And a number of children on this block. And the father told him he got his job was to get the people from 116th Street all the way down to 110th Street. So everybody used to come on 115th Street, my block, and he used to come down there and snatch us up and throw us on the wall and teach us lessons, make sure we went to school. He give us a couple of dollars. You went to school? He said, yeah, he give us a couple of dollars. Mm. And we go to the store and buy stuff. He come down and say, yo, we're giving a rally. He come to the block and make sure all of us come at one spot at one time and we go all the time together at one time. But you had to represent your block and show you who, what you did. You know? That was him, that was him in Mecca. That was him, I'm from Mecca. I'm from Mecca. From Mecca. Right. So he come from, I got the guards on 115th Street and there's so many babies on there. So he, he had to come down and, and give us the knowledge of stuff. So he taught one brother named Righteous out of my crew, you know. So he taught him, and it was a joke. Righteous stopped hanging out with us, and he said, Righteous, why you stop hanging out with us? He said, yo, man, I'm going to see my father. He said, your father? Mm-hmm. Ain't none of us got no father. What are you talking about? He said, yo, let me show you who my father is. Yeah, you better show us who your father is. So he brought us uptown, we sitting there listening. And he kept my mouth shut and did the knowledge, <laughs> you know. And the thing about it that, um, before we met the father or seen anything like this, we were studying message to the black man. You know, Elijah had the message to the black man, and a lot of people around my, in my cycle, we were trying to remember certain passages in the, in the message to the black man, you know? Right, right. So when they said the, who was the original man, being a wise guy, the original man is this, 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 and that. And the Muslims would say, yeah, you're right. And that'd be it, mm. you know? They don't pay too much to the, the babies, they pay attention to the grown adults. adults a lot. So they left us out, you know? So when Black Messiah came on, on the block, he started paying attention to all the children. Mm-hmm. You know, I started to all the children going, knocking on doors, getting us out the block, bringing us up town, going to bus ride, going to movies and stuff. So it was a good thing, you know? But he made sure he went to school, he got an education. Right, you know? right. So, so Black Messiah was, 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 was a couple of years older than like. No, I was a little, I was like two years older than him. I'm 75 right now. Okay, so you're two years older than Messiah? Yeah, I was older than him. Oh, wow, yeah, wow. Okay, okay, so, so what, was your, what was your mindset to see No, see, it's a crew. It's a crew. It's a crew. See, it's a crew. I'm from 15th Street, and we do what we do. We got heart, we, we love each other. So mm-hmm. that, if that's your man, and he's serious, that's my man. Okay. So he right. came to the block, and that's your man, Righteous? He came to the block? Okay, that's so all of us. We're going to do what you want. You doing this, we got to do what you do. You want to see who your father is. And when I'm trying to see him, like, oh, shucks. Tools came back with a righteous name. Yo, come on, BG. Nah, man, I'm not down with that. So they snapped me in the <laughs> So you wasn't, a, you wasn't down with that, I'm the problem. last one to come up town. The last one. I'm the last one to come up town. I came forth. They snatched me, grew up, snatched me up town. What was your, your first, you said you were 17? I was 17. 17. But this is my people, you know? We right. all do each other. We grew up, we were babies. Mothers know each other. My mother and righteous mother, same house. So we all knew, everybody knew each other. That's how the love was. Mm-hmm. This community thing, you know? Right, right, right. So we all went to school. I went to school with everybody. They had knowledge of stuff in the 60s. Went to all boys school, Cooper. Everybody had knowledge in that school. So I'm still to my, I don't get it? Come on, man, I got it. But when they knew I had it, because I was, I was kind of smart anyway. I was hanging around them anyway. I was going to hang around them and don't know nothing. And they definitely asked me questions. Mm. You know, they get inside, yo man, what's this? And we all gotta say the same thing, you know, you ain't studying that? Then get it from him. Mm. Tomorrow you better get it from him and I see you. That's right, how it was. Right, right, right. Ain't no left out in my day. And this is equality and power. It's equality and power when I got it. Right, but you remember what month that was? That was like summertime, summer, summertime. summertime. When we ready to play some ball. Like I said, <laughs> after he snatched us up, we can maybe go play ball and play street, you know, basketball mm. street. Black clothes, everything, we doing our thing. We come down here with four other guards and get on the, get on the wall. And we turn around like, okay, so we know who they is. Now that we play with, you know? Mm. We ain't gonna play with these brothers. But this brother was younger though. He coming up younger now with your man. Black side did not play. He didn't with play. Nobody. He did not play with grown-ups. Mm. So what do you think we already know the, the reputation? You see what I'm saying? So you look know, in them days, you got a reputation, you not to play with people. You know, especially adults. If you older than me, and you reputation, you running around the street doing your thing, I ain't got my job is not to play with you. My job is to sit there and listen to what you say. 
That's how I was back then. Listen and learn. Because if you didn't, you get beat up, you get punched on the arm, head, and the legs. You know, mm -hmm. you go home all sore up. That was like a game, but you right, get you right. to pay attention, you know? If Mega did this. this.